this is the map which says a lot about the place the bus and the stops from which comes from the airport it's well written this is the patong beach which is the opposite side so it takes 11 kilometers and there are blue color tuk tuks as i got the information it charges 40 to 50 baht the cheapest one there are grab bikes and but it's a bit expensive as it's too far there's another map for patong bus which has bus till old time and the blue bus which i was phuket international airport till uh, downtown old town if you want to go so this is the bus near to the foot uh, near to the terminal from where you exit and it just takes 100 baht and one and a half hour to reach there are certain timings which i'll share and uh, mini bus and taxis options are also available so whichever suits you so this is the most convenient and cheapest way to reach from phuket international airport to the old town of phuket the bus which i was saying which goes to patang and this is our current location at the hostel this is the map of old town phuket tourist map weekend market few museums this is the hostel where i am staying queen circuit national park clock tower must visit the yellow building building museums i have never been i haven't been and some elephant sanctuary uh, sorry elephant governor mansion and cooking school uh cooking school i didn't go here then. good day everyone i'm in phuket today is my second day yesterday i landed uh, after landing from the domestic airport i came landing from the domestic airport i came to my hostel the name of the hostel is sunny hostel as you can see the background is amazing uh, Sunny hostel like 200 or 230 baht per night Shared dormitory It's comfortable, clean, no problem The uh, host is friendly uh, Everything is fine uh, You can come in and come out whenever you want So From here many places are nearby Phuket Old Town So as I said I came from bus uh, Which charged me 100 baht from the airport till here And it's 2 or 5 minutes walkable on the map you can see There's really few places I have explored one was the clock tower, it's an iconic one, you should not miss it. It's a good yellow building and uh, be careful, it's a crossing path. Then a uh, few more places which has good architecture, old kind of building, Portuguese style. I don't remember each and everyone's name. In the night I went to Indian night market. It's a good food option, reasonable rates, live music, lovely. Today I'm going to James Bond Island. Point Island and near about places 4 to 5 is a package I'll go. 1500 is the cost, high bar. Uh, it changes from season to season and place to place. I inquired outside also, it's approximately the same. This is the cheapest which I'm getting, it's a good deal as it's an off season. So I have 5 places, I don't remember the name. Some uh, There is a kayaking activity which goes under the cave and then you can see from the top. That's what I have seen from the picture. options near about the restaurants Thai food uh, it's reasonable 60 baht 70 baht not that expensive night market was very cheap 
uh, good options for the light music. You can enjoy it. That happens daily. And Sunday there's a special market at Phuket Old Town, but I'll not be there. So if you are coming on Sunday, you do visit that. That's most recommended by people. Uh, thank you so much. <laughs>